Hello again. It's Wednesday, July 1st, 2020. This is Journal TV and I'm Jerry Clark. It's time for the news. West Rock has made a substantial donation to the Allegheny Highlands Chamber of Commerce and Tourism to help fund this year's fireworks display at the Jackson River Sports Complex in Covington on July 4th. The town of Iron Gate has finished sprucing up its several planters distributed all along its main Route 220 corridor, with volunteer Bridget White chipping in plenty of labor along with a town crew. And now a word from our sponsor. The Allegheny Highlands Christmas Mother Program is getting organized and its board indicated that some changes will have to be made this year. Due to health hazards and limitations, used clothing and toys and used household items cannot be donated. Much more information will be made available soon. Governor Ralph Northam has called new laws historic progress that go into effect today, which include gun safety, a minimum wage law increase, and much more. Log on to AlleghenyJournal.com for a complete list of them. West Rock Corporation has stepped up with yet another local donation, this time to the local agency on aging to help support its Meals on Wheels program for homebound seniors 60 years old and older and we'll be right back. And now for local obituaries. Cecil Walton Sr., 89 of Covington, died Sunday. Enid Holmes, 99 of Lexington, died last Friday. Judy Jeffries, 72 of Covington, died on Monday. More information on all obituaries may be found on AlleghenyJournal.com. It's time to check out the local weather forecast. On Thursday it should be mostly sunny, high of 88 and a low of 66. On Friday, mostly sunny, high of 91 and a low of 68. And on Saturday, partly cloudy with isolated thunderstorms, high of 91 and a low of 68 degrees. And that's the way it is on Wednesday, July 1st, 2020. More stories, photos, videos, and interviews are available 24-7, 365 on AlleghenyJournal.com, YouTube, and on our soaring Facebook page. Thanks very much for watching Journal TV.